all fungi, except for the unicellular yeasts, grow through microscopic strands known as hyphae. The cells of these strands are surrounded by a cell wall of chitin and may be divided from each other in some hyphae by septa. In many fungi, these septa are perforate and allow the transport of materials and even cellular organelles between cells. In some fungi, the hyphae do not form septa and materials can transport throughout the organism through cytoplasmic streaming. Hyphae can form large mats, large collections of hyphae, known as mycelia. In a mycelium, the thin strands have such a large surface area to volume ratio because the cells are not fused to form one solid body that this allows for a very large percentage of the fungal cells to touch the material that they are digesting, whether this be dead material being decomposed or living material in a parasitic fungus. The fungal cells excrete enzymes which digest this material and the simpler biomolecules which result from the digestion can then be absorbed for nutrition. These mycelial mats are typically far more extensive than we realize. In a forest floor, if one observes multiple mushrooms in an area, typically they are the same organism connected to this underground mycelial mat. In the state of Oregon, it was discovered that one mycelial mat, apparently from one single individual, stretches for an area of about four square miles. And so therefore this fungus would be the largest organism on earth.